what is the most important thing for this event in terms of the fans, the relationship that you have with the Warburg family? How important is this event to them? Well, it's something that we can sort of end the first part of the season with uh, before we go off on Christmas break. We can all get together and sort of meet each other out in a different location. Uh, it's fun to come to Vegas. It's a great recruiting tool for us as far as telling uh, student athletes that if they're with our program, they're going to end up in Vegas four times during their career. Uh, the parents love to come out here. It's an exciting town, but it's also a great place to see some wrestling that we wouldn't normally see from across the United States. Back here for the Desert Duels. I love this event. I love this event, you know, and I love it for a lot of reasons. But one, I mean, just, just look around right here. An opportunity to wrestle in a ballroom with chandeliers. I mean, it's, it's so unique to anything that we do all year long. Um, you know, typically we're in gyms, we're in field houses, arenas. Um, this, is, this is the only time you do something like this in a, in a ballroom. And, you know, it's cool for our guys because, I mean, you look at where these seats are at, they're mat side, you know, and so. Fans are right on top of you. Um, they're getting to wrestle right in front of people they know and love. And you know, just the opportunity to come out here. And we got guys that have, that have never been on airplanes before, you know, at times. That, that this is their first opportunity to fly, come to this city. There's a lot to see, a lot to do. Um, but you know, I remind them, it's a business trip. This is a business trip and it's important to us. How we compete out here, it's real important. Um, so knowing that, you know, coming out here with the goal in mind, but also getting to experience things that you normally wouldn't get experience. And, you know, for example, yesterday, you know, we went to the UFC Performance Institute and, you know, you had Dan Ige and Punahaley Soriano, two of our former alums that wrestled for us, um, that were able to get us in there. And, I mean, these guys loved it. They loved it. What an awesome opportunity going in through the, the Performance Institute, seeing all these fighters that they see, that they watch on TV weekly. Um, and using those facilities. So just, just experiences, you know? I mean, life is about experiences and relationships. And, you know, you got an opportunity when you come to Vegas to have experiences. And for us as coaches, the extra amount of time that we get to spend with them and continue to grow relationships and spend time together, uh, it's priceless. So it's a valuable trip, you know? And then, and then you add in all the parents, alums, boosters that come out here for this, you know? And, and it's awesome for our parents that they get a chance to all connect We'll have socials put on, you know, where they get to spend time together, our boosters and our alums. So it's, uh, you know, it, it encompasses a lot of things that, that you want to hit as a program in one weekend. It was just a good environment being able to have, you know, three Warburg teams wrestling and getting you know, two, three duels for each of them. And the, I mean, the biggest thing is watching all of our guys cheer on our guy, all the other guys and being able to be mat side. It's a pretty unique environment. You know, the fans are right on top of you and people are cheering and guy, it, guys are wrestling hard and wrestling through every position. How does this help build morale? I mean, I would imagine going for national championships, this kind of event kind of solidifies the team. I mean, it's something that we kind of talk about early on is, you know, 
it kind of closes out the first semester and we're able to kind of evaluate how the first semester goes. We finish up finals and we fly right out here and we're able to compete and get some matches. And then everyone flies home and takes a little break and then we're back training for national duels. What do you think this event means to Wartburg and to the school's wrestling program? Well, I think it's a kind of a tradition with uh, all the years that uh, Wartburg's been able to host this tournament out here. And um, it's a great opportunity for the wrestlers and parents and boosters to come out here to Las Vegas and uh, support the wrestling team and at the same time enjoy uh, their time here. I haven't got to watch my sons wrestle live in a year for Rudy almost and two years for Reese because he got injured. And so I'm just really excited to watch them get back on the mat and do what they love. And what makes Warburg Wrestling so special? Well, I feel like um, it's pretty special to have a couple of brothers from Wyoming on the team. It's pretty unique. and. Um, we hadn't even heard of the school until the boys got reached out to by a coach and a fan. And then when we went and looked at Wartburg, we all kind of fell in love with it right away. They have a really great athletic program. There's a group of us boosters that um, help set all this up, uh, get all the mats in, get all the timing and scoring uh, equipment set up. Um, we had some help this year from the UNLV club team, and we really appreciate that, and all the other boosters that uh, help out get this thing set up and make it successful. Yeah. 30 seconds left in the match. You got to work. Do something here. Get a takedown in order to tie it up. Dance is gonna do everything he can to stay on his feet. You gotta work, grind, shine. It's mine. Gotta show everybody it's my time. Getting here, you gotta work, grind, shine. Never mind. I'm talking down because they lie. Don't talk. You gotta to work. Avoid our from grabbing you gotta his work. Legs Ten seconds left. You gotta work. You gotta work. Yeah. Five, you gotta four, work. Yeah. Three, you gotta work. I'm going two, hard like Kobe inside one, the gym. Take point. I'm a diamond in dirt, a hidden gem. Going for greatness, I gotta win and by any means. Right Cause eight, I don't know three, when I'll be back again. There. Going hard, Dancing I gotta get it. it, man. I can't even lie. I put in so much sweat, my body running dry. I shed so many tears, now I don't wanna cry. Now it's coming easy to me. All I had to do was try. I had to work, push myself through Please it, even though I knew it hurt. Look as you do it right, it don't matter who do it first. first. Never say day yourself here short, know your work. I knew I wasn't one end. since birth. I had to work, grind, shine, it's mine. Three, gotta four, show nine, everybody seven, it's nine. my time. Getting here, you gotta work, grind, shine. Never mind who talking down, cause they lying. Don't talk, you gotta work. You gotta work. You've been coming here 20 years. How does, 
how does that feel? Just to be, continue to come here for 20 years. It kind of makes me feel old, to be honest with you. Um, no, you know, it's 20 years of, of having an amazing experience. And, you know, each and every team has got to come out here and experience that. And, you know, I think that says something about the commitment that Warburg has for wrestling. Um, the athletic department has for our wrestling program to be able to have this opportunity. Um, but, you know, there's a lot of hard work that goes into this event, you know, and Joe and Julie, you know, they, very, in the very beginning, all the work that they did to, to get this thing off the ground and to continue just to help make it evolve and grow. Um, you know, this is, this is an important event to a lot of people. And, you know, running a tournament's a lot of work to begin with. Running a tournament in Las Vegas when you live in Iowa is a whole other deal, you know. And so um, there's a lot of special people that, that this, this event means a lot to. And, you know, you, you, you see that in the way things are set up. You see that in the way things are ran. Um, and, and really the whole weekend for our fans and for our, our, even our kids and the opportunities they get. So, you know, it, it, it's crazy. It's 20 years. It, it, it goes like that, you know, for me. Um, but there's, you know, I, there's a lot of special memories and just... It's, it's exciting that each group gets to continue to do this. Yeah. You gotta work. You gotta work. Ride, shine, it's mine. Gotta show everybody it's my time. Get in here, you gotta work. Ride, shine, never mind who talking down. Cause they lie, don't talk, you gotta work. You gotta work. You gotta work. You gotta work. Yeah. You gotta work. Yeah. You gotta work. I'm going hard like Kobe inside the gym. I'm a diamond in the dirt, a hidden gym. Going for greatness, I gotta win by any means. Cause I don't know when I'll be back again. Going hard, I gotta get it, man. I can't even lie. I put in so much sweat. My